All right, dudes. Play some, uh, honey, I joined a cult today. It's our new game. Figure out what we're gonna, kind of cult we're gonna make. Hopefully they updated this game, because this game was kind of hard when I first played it. Cult of the Space Fish, day 52. I think it's really going that badly. Well, yes. Oh man, we got protests. We got we're getting we're getting raided. Burn biscuits. But a special observer, observer observation bureau raid. The people are are brainwashed. They're just practically just delusional. Take this punk for instance. He's covered in blue house paint. That's not house paint. He's begun his transcension into space into a space fish. Fish. Sort him out. Yes, boss. Fish. Ah, uh, oh, fish. But boss about sure this is paint. Of course not. I told you he's part space fish. Amazing. A miracle. Holy moly. Nonsense. It's probably just that really stubborn paint. Just get him out of here. Fish? This place is done for. We're shutting shutting it down. But I did nothing wrong. Although we cannot prove you actually lifted a finger around here. Everyone else is still to be taken away. For processing. What's more important, the most important in, is that I'm free. I want you out of here, out of here, out of the dust bowl tonight, punk. I mean, yeah, of course. Officers will seal all this, all this off shortly. All right, let's roll out of this dump. Tob, we're finished now. The SOB. Even if there was evidence, which there is, there is. Okay. This not like what he's saying. Apparently he's saying there's evidence that he did stuff, but... He's running away with all the cash. Ugh. Am I saying fish? You ain't see me, right? Uh, what? Gah! Because it punched him. I've been given a second chance. Time to change my ways. Excuse me? Oh. Time to change my ways. Time to... Oh, who am I kidding? Time to rebuild and just reestablish contact with a new divine being. Man. First I need some serious cosmic, er, cosmic surgery to change my appearance. Good thing I know a guy. Cosmetic, not cosmic. Get some cosmic surgery. Oh, man. Damon Joy's band. Sure it is. We are cosmic surgery. Alright, um... What do we want our... Call some of the bay. Do we want to be when we when we Christmas elf cult now? Dinosaur cults now. Capitals cults. What do we even have? Atom bombs. We got music, motorcycles, Egyptian stuff. Yeah. That John Lennon, what the heck? Alright, um I need the call to the cat. Call, call to the elder gods. Name name of the Christmas Dawn. 
Um, the elders. Santa Claus is the is there? No, I don't. What? No. Cthulhu. Yeah, that's our name. That's our uh, our god. Captain Crimbo. Carol. Carol Management. Oh, damn, why am I so tired of what's on the heck? I hate this. Um... Yeah, well, you got pre-made... What's it going to be pre-made cults? Cult of the Moon. Cult of the Christmas Dawn. Children of the Saurus. The F Flum Family. Temple of the Atom. The Cult of the Maddening Dark. I might just go with this. It's already pre-made or pre-made, um... The pre-made, pre uh... Pre-made, uh, Cthulhu cult. Cool. Difficulty settings can be modified at various values within the game to make the game both easier and harder to suit your preference. Will these settings can be changed at any point during the game? Relaxed. For an easier play style with less pressure and on resources allows the player to build and flourish. More extravagant, extravagant bases. With fewer interruptions. Progress is faster but has less uh, interaction and micromanagement. Standard. Okay, so oh, if we change anything, then it's okay. The premium achievements will just okay. So if I lower anything lower than the red, then our achievements are unlocked or blocked. I haven't played this game in a while, so it's played relaxed. Uh, Charlie, what's no? A high priest is gonna be me, right? That's going ten. High priest, facial hair. I can't even see. I need. To, I'm sorry. I hate the. Need to change. What? How? How do you change color? I like. Is it does. Skin color. I want to like. Oh, here we go. No. This is his face. How do I change his hair? There's is skin color. There we go. Yeah, that's the color I am. They have my facial hair? I don't think they do. I guess that's probably closest, the closest thing I'm going to get. Uh, head. Oh, man. Excuse me. What do you want for... There we go. I don't really see much of our clothes. I right, start. Let's start with this. Start with this nonsense. Hello, world. Hello. I'm Matt Scullington, but you can call me High Priest. Welcome to M the Maddening Dark. The Great Old One told me you were coming. The Great Old One tells me I loads of stuff. Just me, though. Nobody else can hear it. The Great One also told me you were going to help me, or help me get the Watchers up and running. It's pretty much your destiny. Uh, I'm more of an idea person, though, so you're going to have to do uh, the groundwork. 
You can't run a cult if you can't see the cult. Move the camera. These buttons, yeah, okay. Gotta zoom in. Uh, zoom out. Okay. Oh, sorry. Sometimes you want to take a few moments to consider a great old one's plans. Next. Great. At other times, you want people to get a move on and pause the game, increase the max speed. Let's not do that. Uh, let's return to normal. Yeah, normal speed. We did that. Watchers are an engine of our organization. They perform all the daily duties. Keep everything running smooth-ish. Save for the missions they are sent on. Watchers spend their entire lives at the beautiful compound. They are truly blessed. Most importantly, watchers extract money from our visiting, visiting followers. We need this money to realize the mysterious grand plan of the Great One. Ugh. Let's see how our watchers are doing. Pick the most attractive one. Uh, this, this person. Uh, really not not who I would have chosen the mood bar shows the overall mood of each watcher everything ever affecting everything affecting the mood of the watcher is listed in the mood selection looks like they're happy on the inside let's see what other information we have on them and then uh, level tab you can get information on the watcher level and skill points skill points can be a Allocated when the cultist levels up. On the level, uh, the level tab, you can get information on the watcher's level and skill points. Skill points can be allocated when the cultist levels up. On the proprieties tab, take tab, you can control what the watcher jobs of watchers do. In the priority tab, okay, so we know that already. Schedule tab allows you to control when a watcher works. We will eventually discover rooms that will only be worked at night. I find the watchers generally work better than two. Managing so many watchers can be overwhelming, especially when the organizing condition gets bigger. The watcher's menu will allow you to view the moods of everyone at once. Uh, so one of the skills uh, tab allow you to to compare the skills of everyone. Some of the people really aren't up up to much, but they they'll get better each, with time, hopefully. Here you can view the traits and the quirks of the everyone. Some of these people truly are special in the worst possible sense. Uh. Wow. Prefers to work in a room that, are, that contains rugs. Prefers not to work in rooms that uh, interact with followers. Prefers not to work in the module room. Prefers to work in the kitchen, our maintenance room. Okay. Prefers not to work on module rooms. What are module rooms? Scared of the dark. Prefers the decor light source. There were they sleeping at night. There's always something down there in the dark waiting for it to come out. The party band will allow you to see which of your watchers are available for which jobs. The party, okay. Ugh. Schedule tab allows you to see what people are scheduled to work. Note that some jobs can only be worked during the daytime hours, and others can only be nighttime hours. The hours in the dark are blue at the top. Okay. So these hours are nighttime hours. All right. Everything needs to be a solid foundation, even buildings. Let's construct some now. The foundation select to drag the area of the foundation. 
Uh, what do we want? Bricks, concrete, gray, metal, wood. Oh, concrete. Why not? I guess it's this big, right? Build a door. I guess we shouldn't have cell doors yet. That's just, that's just weird. Uh, partition? Now it's partition... What's well, not partition area so we have enough space for multiple rooms? The rooms can be pretty cramped. They'll do for now. You'll want to expand them later. Are there any walls? No, just delete wall. Demand it. Demol uh, demolish. Demolish. Demol Demol what? I don't know what I'm saying. Demolish. Not demolish. What the hell is that word? Oh, I gotta build a wall down the middle. Why is it not? There it goes. Well done, the Great Ones. Uh, the Great One says to tell you that they're very pleased. Let's designate some rooms now. I should have built some doors. A tired watcher won't perform their duties well. Their chit chat is also super dry. Uh, they'll need to sleep in bed to replenish their energy. Let's assign a bedroom so we have something somewhere to sleep. Once completed, exit the room assigned. Okay. The bedroom. Uh, what? I did, did I not do that? There it goes. Good work, the uh, room menu automatically opens when you assign a new room. To show you the objects the room requires, this one needs a bed and some storage. How many cultists do we have? We have... We need five beds, at least. We need, a, we need a lamp, apparently. So it's one, two, three, four, five. Storage box. One, two, two, three, four, five. Uh, you're not ghost yet. Fill the door now. The doors and the other objects can be rota rota rotated. Let's put a cell door on our bedroom. New work watchers will sleep in beds during the assigned sleep time and their schedule. We make equip an object. Uh, light. Light fitting? It's a light source. Vision indoors. Uh, it's just. Danny Light in here. I, I guess I can't do that stuff yet. Alright, whatever. Um, build a door assigned for bathroom. It's better for everyone if watchers have access to toilets and showers. Yeah, it is. Alright, let's put another cell door on here. You're natural. Let's place some bathroom objects. Objects in the room menu. Okay. Uh, spinning wood. Uh, how do we rotate? R? That doesn't really do anything, does it? Oh, okay, two. It wants me to be able to only build two of each. A toilet bucket, really? That's gross. Could have done better myself. Watchers will raise their bladder and hygiene stats in the bathroom. Ordering people are around or about is necessary and fun. Select the watcher. Notice that, they're, that usable ob objects are highlighted in the green. Let's force somebody to use the new toilet buckets. Right click the bucket. 
Great stuff. Um, I don't think they're even really ready or really wanted to go. Commanding order watches to do lots of things that way. Uh, this is our this this outbuilding isn't really my style. Let's get rid of it before we build anything else. Delete wall. Use the delete wall tool if you want to get rid of a wall that keeps the underlying foundation. It removes the wall. Now let's make the cycle disappear. Get rid of the whole thing. Demolish tool. Oh, the like groovy music to this game. Okay, the canteen serving watchers will will tend to die. I know that's a, for this for a fact. Build a canteen here. And a door. Uh, rooms. We want the canteen. Build the vending machine. Water cooler. <gasps> Serving table. And a table. Table. Can I build two? No, it's not going to only build two right now. Very nice watchers will eat in the canteen in the free time when they're hungry. These are hunger stats. Some scientists believe that vending machine food is not particularly nutritious. It could also be expensive. A kitchen will provide better quality, cheaper food, like gruel. You might want to build one in the future. Uh, these rooms are built, they're hideous. Uh, placing some decor items will help. Uh, razor, okay, so we need to, we need to, um, we need a light in the bedroom, didn't we? It was like that guy that needed a light. We'll put potted pines in the bathroom. Table mirror. I'll put a mirror in the bathroom. And then uh, in here, we'll maybe a cupboard. There we go. I like, uh, I like what we've done with the place. Placing ob objects within a room contribute to that room's siege score. This is based on the highest six items within the room. With other items providing diminishing returns, placing the core high prestige items can help boost the score, whilst having too little free space or broken items can reduce it. Each room also has a prestige level. This is based on the current prestige score of the room and can be increased by hitting certain thresholds. The prestige level is com compared against a cultist level and see how happy they are for being in this room. Um, the prestige level is okay. Uh, a watcher will gain mood buffs or debuffs based on the difference between their level and the prestige level of the room they are in. Prestige levels and prestige scores are visible on a scores info panel. This one's at a prestige level of 11. Okay. Why is somebody praying? The great old one is going. Will go crazy. We need to. We need to hold a sermon right now, please. Holding a sermons in the holy room creates faith. Faith is drained each by each watcher. If it gets too low, everyone's mood will suffer. Let's hold our first sermon before everyone stops believing the great old one. Um, sermons will occur automatically each day, providing the holy room is full, fully functioned, accessible. You have to not. And have enough influence. Look like our first sermon is about to start. Wait until the sermon finishes. Gone. Welcome. You guys are happy. You guys make me laugh. Ooh woo. Love you guys. Ooh woo. Ah, smoochy face. You guys are happy. Love you guys. The great old one is in your watcher in, is in you watchers.
And that was all true in the end. Okay, so our happiness is not... I guess I need to go to the, the toity. They love that sermons are more efficient if they are in good mood because before they start. Take a lot of high priest energy though. Let's let's let them space them out. Uh, you can change the, t the time of, of sermon occurs in the holy room sidebar. Manual sermons can be triggered. There is a, if a scheduled sermon fails to start it for any reason. Uh, sermon tab. It, or at 9, 1900. This one's pretty new, but they'll quickly gain experience through performing various tasks around the base, going through, going, or, and going on missions. I used some secret powers from the great old one to provide some instant experience through one of your watchers. Select the watcher. Vanessa. Every time uh, uh, you level a Watcher up, get an LK of two points, choose a skill that you want to increase and finish the leveling process. Okay, so she works in reception, right? So... Uh, um, increases healing, therapy rooms, Bobby. Increases recruitment chance. Espionage, intelligence. Three rooms, recruitment office. Is there anything? Okay, so let's put one in social and one in bluffing. Uh, so what is she? What is her? What are her traits? Chronic injuries, and she's a petty criminal. And when she when leaving a call, this half takes longer time to recover from injuries. Level cap is three, but skill cap is five. I mean, we eventually will get rid of people and like get better people. That's heading work. Keep an eye out for any watcher with the next level indicator above them. Think about what role the watcher is best suited. To upgrade their skills accordingly. Powers are the main source of income, but but first we need to convince them to join us. Huh. What am I? Am I sitting on my headphone thing? Ah, head? Yes. What is? I'm all tangled up. There we go. This is the lobby increases and in, in, interested people will go there and talk to the receptionist. A decent receptionist is important, so try to make someone who can string a sentence together. If the receptionist does a good job, the person will join us as a follower and start to visit us and uh, our therapy rooms regularly. You know what people really love? Paving tiles. Uh, they're such a dummy. People follow paved paths. If there's a route available, it's not ridiculously long, otherwise they'll walk on the grass. Alright. Half. Um, but up, but up, but up, but let's go with these. I met somebody at the bar yesterday and they said they would drop by and check us out. They should be here any moment. Wow, they are look different to how I or look different to how I remember. I wonder if they're still interested. Let's see. Can I follow this person? No, oh, okay. Bread versus butter. Spread. Oh, what you like butter? No, get out of here, nerd. I'm in. That's our first follower, pretty sure it was was my bar chat that made the difference. Let's take a closer look at how our, our new follower.
Pretty much just make you live longer. <laughs> Chewing gum picker? Wow, okay. Uh, the bio tab is, will give you basic information of the We attract some strange types. The level tab provides information on the interests of the fowler and any progress they've made in the module room. Um, view information on what each module room does by hovering the mouse over each room icon. Hypo chamber, monolith room, or the pool of prevalence. Okay. Facing course can be viewed in the stats tab only once the Fowler has completed a pool of revelations module. You can find overview information on all followers here. We're gonna have up to 16 followers? Okay. Overview of the follower stats information can be viewed here once you've been revealed. You can be useful in determining which follower you want to keep and which aren't worthy of the great one. Bowers are the, are the cash cow that we needed us to milk. They're happily paid us off sort of strange treatments in our therapy rooms. This meditation room studio is a therapy room that Fowers will pay to use. Sometimes I say I'm meditating, but I'm actually asleep. Fowers will leave if there are no therapy rooms available or they are bored of the current ones. Go as many different therapy rooms as you can to keep the money flowing. Remember, it's all for the great one. I'm feeling a bit guilty about splashing so much money on those luxury toilet buckets. But the watch have earned $25 from our followers to show your, their gratitude. You could spend, speed up the or pause time using the controls at the bottom right. Okay. We gotta, we've earned uh, $12 so far. Where is the... I change change people's names. Miss Fowler. Oh, okay. Once they join, I can change their names. Excellent. They clearly love the great old one much, or very much. My friend from the bar looks pretty desperate. I'm reckon they join our ranks if we ask them. Select the file, recruit the new watcher. Then I gotta build a new... Ah, okay. Deciding. They're deciding they want to join us or not. Oh, I think they joined. I'll hell Matt Scullington. Those are, those are quirking on that stuff. Ah, uh, so procrastinator. I'll get an XP more slowly. Okay, nice. Conspiracy theorist? Module discuss. We're not prefer work in module rooms. Welcome to the party, pal. For the Manning and Dark to be successful, we need to manage our resources carefully. Various resources are used to research new rooms. Upgrade existing ones and buy necessity items. Others are used to in, as an indicator of how well received Manning Dark is in the local community. Money is, is used to purchase items and build new rooms. We need to keep our pockets lined if we want to live a comfortable life. The great old one de definitely wants that. Money is a primary earned through therapy rooms as a way for followers to thank us for the life changing experience they will no doubt have. Faith is an indicator of how much Watcher believes in the cause. Each Watcher will cost us faith each day, so it's important to always have enough. We don't want them to leave. Faith is earned through daily sermons. This is where I got in trouble last time. I built my my uh, my alt up too fast. But once you research the cool looking new technology, influence is what you need. Influence is used to research new rooms and upgrades. It's wonderful that you can get a watcher to look into with a little lot, a little bit of influence. Influence is primarily earned by our followers using their therapy rooms the same way as money. Maintaining our reputation in the local community is important. This will be is where PR 
comes in, by increasing our PR, we can attract better quality flowers to potentially recruit later. PR is gained through missions. We can also be lost when watchers and flowers leave. Don't worry, officer. Nothing to see here. Heat is an indicator of how much negative attention Manning Dark is getting. If it gets too high, we'll have be subject to protests or even police raids. He can be reduced by emissions, or will gradually change over time based on how many flowers we've attracted. If you ever need need a detailed breakdown of resource income, resource income, full stats page is available via the resource button. Open. Okay. Now, uh, create a research room. Uh, we need a door, don't we? Builds. Let's put a cell door on. Yep. Uh, research desk. And a supercomputer. It's a decor item. Well, this may need a, like a rug or something. Oh, we don't, we don't have any rugs. Uh, let's put a potted plant in here. Why not? Quadras won't be in research office unless you assign a research task, though so let's do it now. Uh, start research, or start maintenance room research in the research office. Excellent, the bar will increase when the watchers are working in the research office. Once the research is complete, you'll need to assign new research task. Wait for the maintenance room research to be complete, then review the research menu. Ah, they get it. Research. How do I? Isn't she my person that works in the lobby? No. Well, she's the one I, I just recruited. And then we'll have to build a... Build a maintenance office. Pew pew! We have oh well, yeah, they're building their bed and stuff because I'm not. I guess I can't right now because we're still doing a tutorial. I watch what's used in the room. Why I wonder. The compound repairing broken item, repoken, repairing broken items and clearing clutter. Great one, uh, the great one talks to me about a lot of different things. Be it summoning great octopus creatures, building a robot armies, or striving to world peace, this, this, there really is it open to interpretation. Once you build a leader's sanctum, we'll be able to choose which direction to go in. Whatever we do, we need money, so let's make sure the flowers are regular, get out of regular flow of flowers. I watch our game experience by performing tasks and going out on missions. Okay. Get our demands. Little will sometimes make 
leader demands. The best way to pay attention to these is, is they could be offered a reward for completing quests or impose a penalty for certain conditions not met. There's two types of these. Quests have specific goals to complete and can either offer rewards for completion or impose penalty. <laughs> um... Research and build, uh, Leader's Sanctum. Okay, uh, where is the Leader's Sanctum? Sermon of Extra Faith, Recreational Room. What's the Leader's Sanctum? Bathroom Upgrade, Watcher Room, uh, Fool, Pool. Therapy, spirit chamber, recruitment, objects, kitchen, PR missions, recreational room, term faith. Where is aid station? Moon, moon, idol, sermon, sermon. I'm going to find what you're looking for. Tired, tired of endlessly scrolling through menus. We've got your covered. Search. Okay, so we can search things. Um, so I need to build another. I need to build another bed. We're, how do we? But now we can build stuff. And then we need another storage. Uh, okay, so that's built. What do you, what is, okay, so Grace Anderson, what do you, I don't know what, know what you do. Okay. Receptionist. Staff manager. Staff manager. Miss Huffman's researcher. Okay. Um. Maintenance room. We're gonna build a maintenance room real quick. So ten by seven. Uh. Bamy Leaf leveled up, gained disorganized. You got disorganized. What the, why? Wow, because you went negative in some things. What can I tell him, like, what job to freaking do? Oh, okay. So I'm going to figure out who's good at what, and then tell them to go do that stuff. Let's get this built first, and then... Well, uh... I can't, I'm gonna, can, I, can I build over this? No. Um... So we need walls. And door. Let's not have a uh, let's see the room. This would be a maintenance room. Cleaning cart, tool trolley, workbench. So that's built. Okay, so Vanessa, just lobby meditation, of madness.
practical. Um, she's good at bluffing. She's good at social. Over mission. Tr okay, so. I need to build a sanctum room or whatever. Garma periodically becomes now. Kitchen sermon mood boost. Freedom office spiritual cha chamber. I just generate money. Um. This is like the thing that the dude wanted. So, what was her name? Carol? This lady. She's gonna be our researcher. Um, Grace. It's Grace. Who had the... She's gonna work in the lobby. Do you have any point you have skill you do have skill points. Uh do you have a thing where you don't want to work certain places? Flowing their pants. Uh so them in a temple of madness. We did researcher. Okay, wait, where's Watchers? Maintenance room. It's a tower. So Bombing Leaf does not want to work. Module. So I guess a module would be Oh, maybe I should make Grace my maintenance person then. Ten points. What's, what's good for maintenance? Bobby, kitchen, office, convert, research. Okay. Well, for nothing like for the maintenance office. Module progress, feed lobby, kitchen, maintenance, there we go, maintenance room. Put two, put, put two in maintenance and then we'll put two in butchery. As well as to make them my cook. Um, there's one I'm working on modules, cook, clean, John. He doesn't want to do, he doesn't want to cook, so. No maintenance. He doesn't want to sleep. Where's not work in the kitchen or maintenance room? Oh, maybe we should make him my cook then. She's scared of the dark. Vanessa's scared of the dark. We're not to work in a module room. 
person have to work in a module room. Who is my... So what's a module room? I guess... I don't know what a module room is. These module rooms? I don't know what a module room is. She's just mad about... Oh, because she's talking to people. Okay. I gotcha. So what do we... Was there something about, like, he wanted... Uh, research and build leader sanctum. Unlock missions during research and divine inspiration. You know, actual, um... Sir, there... Where's the leader sanctum? Requires maintenance room, mood boost. Why am I... We have... Bobby maintenance room, research room, temple of madness. No. Temple of madness. So he wants us to research... The sanctum. Use my watch to increase your fun needs. Recruitment office, spiritual chamber. Money a small amount, because snow. Recreational room. Recreational room. PR. Does it tell me what modules are? Oh, it's telling me, okay, the requirements. So where is the inner. Bathroom. Faith, watch, or cap. Bathroom. A room boost. Recreational room, flower cap. No? More speed. Comfy pews. Bathroom upgrade. Convert ops. Flower cap. Where, okay, so I'm, where am I... Leader Sanctum is way the fuck over here. Tired mood, mood break recovery. Like, how long do we have to do this? Didn't say. Okay. So where are you working? You are... staff member. What is, what is, what is he doing? I don't understand what they're doing. Like, why is red? Yeah. 
This is living house? I don't know why. Time for, for rebrand. The choices of cult in your form might I felt like a best fashion decision at the time, but we all know taste change. If you're having second thoughts about your customization decisions, you can change them by going to cult inter overview. Okay. So let's get them to sleep through the night. What rooms? Okay, what rooms can I build? I can build... We got a bathroom, we got a bedroom, we got a canteen, we got a lobby, we got me in room, research, temple of men, okay. So we got the therapy rooms. I think I need another table in here, though. There we go. I need, to make a, I need to make rooms bigger. I don't know, like, how big to make rooms. No missions available, okay. So let's speed our thing up so we can start getting research and shit done. So how do we increase influence? Gain from powers visiting the compound and complete... Okay. And this is like slowly going down. For every person we have. Alright. Yeah, I need more... Okay, so I need like better... Like bigger showers and... I think they're gonna start getting sick from like improper... Bathrooms and stuff. Yeah, watcher was injured. Broken f filter bits? Dirty hands uh, whilst eating. One of your watches is injured. An injured watcher will struggle to perform their duties. Watcher's gotten ill from eating dirty, f dirty hands. I know I'm starting to see how using an old trough of things probably isn't the most hygienic choice. After going to the toilet, watchers will struggle to clean their hands properly with the poor quality sinks. It's great, need better. Okay, so we need better sinks now. Uh, did we start our research? Kitchen. Where do we get better bathrooms? Bathroom upstairs after we get a kitchen. Is there anybody that's not happy with the situation? What's up, Fine Guy and Cat? I'm gonna catch you live. I'm gonna work. Alright, cool. Thanks for the work, I appreciate it. Yes, I have I have mad facts now about myself. Um, you might, it might be useful to make sure some of your watchers take different lunch breaks so they always have some, okay, so I need to spread, mess up, okay. Uh, ba -ba -ba, mood boost unlocked. We need to pitch in. Get a nerd person. Uh, we're, okay, we need to change our schedule a little bit. Where was our... Where our herd is? Is there a schedule? How do I... Stagger our launch.
It's like that. Job priorities ensure that a watcher are always assigned a job that best matches their skills. Avoiding a task that they will aren't great at. Assigning a skilled worker to a job will offer great benefits such as increased research output and faster completion of tasks. To update a watcher's priorities, simply open... Can we not do this? We've done this already. Mood boost update, uh, upgrade, or up unlock. Oh my god, mood boost unlocked. Goodness. You can now boost the watcher's mood. Life in a compound can be tough. Sometimes it helps to get a comment from the high priest. If somebody is particularly struggling, I can give them a quick pep talk and get them back on track. This comes at a cost. I'm a leader, not a therapist. If I lose, not lose some influence by being too soft on our watchers. We need both smart toilet buckets. Toilet, toilet buckets. How many? How many? Got th okay, so we're up to three flowers now. That's good. There they are. There they are. You need your money. You need your money, you nerds. And all that influence. I feel like I can't zoom. Too, it's too crowded. It's like down a little. Restricted space. Total. Okay, so I need to make my my thing look bigger. Can't see it a little bit bigger, I guess. Do, 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 do. Um, I don't know how much bigger to make it though. Can I move things? Uh, canteen. Objects. Why not? I'll move object. to we go. There we go. That's a little bit better. Yeah, people are halfway using my meditation room. I'm gonna build some more rooms. Ah, uh, so research is done. We can, we can, we can cook now. But we need to... We get better bathrooms. Let's go with the better bathrooms next. People can stop getting food sickness or food illnesses. Let's build a kitchen. I can't direct my walls. I didn't put my walls back up. Let's see, concrete. That's all I need, right? They're, they're just in a cult. They don't care what it is. This there. Uh, we want to make this the kitchen. Quiet room 8 by 6. Okay, so let's tell me what size it should be. Okay, we got our fridge. A sink. Oven. And a work top. Air, cool, 100. Our sermons are on, let's see, we got negative, we went through a, we lost a thousand dollars. Lost 111 influence, gonna refresh some stuff. We got uh, almost 500 faith back, nice. Uh, I need somebody to start working in a kitchen. Uh, who's 
We haven't been good. It's good working in the kitchen. Probably not. Um, I see. Kitchen. Oh, there was like somebody who like doesn't like to work with the public, isn't there? Um, watchers. There's somebody that like to work in the kitchen, so they're gonna work in the kitchen. Like rugs. So Sean likes. I'm gonna put the Sean in the kitchen. I'll see he's our air, our maintenance guy. So, this is what he likes, right? Yeah. First, I'll work in a kitchen and a maintenance room, so that's what he does both. Uh, food doesn't cook itself. It's There's a quick guide to how to prep new meals for your watchers. First, you need to purchase ingredients so they, the chef can get to work. This is done via order a tab in the kitchen uh, or room sidebar, which I did. Simply purchase the ingredients, then assign a worker in the kitchen to get started. Increasing the butchery and, and improvisation, improvisation skills will increase the chances of successfully preparing a meal. Cooked meals are served in your canteen. You can set up which meals are served in your canteen using the serve tab, the canteen sidebar. Uh, serve. Gruel. Yes, we're serving gruel. Mmm. Tasty, tasty gruel. Sean, Sean, where's Sean? Because oh, Sean's working in the maintenance room and... Okay, so we need to upgrade you. I saw that. Um, butchery, we need two. And then improvisation needs two. I also had somebody else that's working in it. Is there somebody else that's working in the, um... There's a maintenance person and... Module discussed when I'm working module. I don't know what module rooms are. Nessa Dusman is working in the lobby. Where is it? Their skill points. There it is. Alright. Uh, Fami is. Where's, is Fami working anywhere? Or no. Prefers not to work in rooms that interact with flowers. Prefers to work in rooms that contain rugs. Well, shit, I don't have any rooms that I can put you in right now that don't have flowers or whatever. But I don't like what the upgrader greater stuff to. Alright. So we got we got two people working in the maintenance room and two in, in the kitchen. I have a researcher, I think. Yeah, I have a researcher. Are they permanently researching now? Let's see here. Search, research. Carol Huffman. Yes. Oh, in research. Okay. Did I give her by accident? No. Oh, you have no. Okay. You don't. You haven't leveled up yet. Sleepy time. Yeah. We, okay. Kitchen. Yeah. We got that. We know kitchen. Sleepy time. We're trying to upgrade our bathroom so we get better bathrooms going. We're not pissing and crapping in a bucket. That's gross. And basically taking a shower in a, in a bucket? Bucket of string. Yeah. Okay. The sink prof. I should be my... Priest have his own room, I feel like. We're gonna unlock missions too soon. What are we, okay, so we're researching better bathrooms. I guess we'll do PR missions next. We can start doing missions. It's all this cabbage stuff. We 
have? Okay, do we have? <laughs> Write some sign, bitches. <gasps> Got no gruel prepared. What is this? Is that like the keep it always thing ordered? Uh, sanitation, 75%. Mood effect, time to eat, 20 minutes. Cooking difficulty... Uh, no. It's like... Looks like ground up roadkill. Gross. I feel like this is like an auto... I'll break a uh, Grubber's bread. Uh, uh, Gruber's beard shocks experts. Beard growth virus running rampant. An annual outbreak of... Rubber's beard has taken the city by surprise this year. Usual, unusual outbreaks only affect middle-aged white men, but this time it's certainly different. Nobody seems to be safe currently, be it men, women, or children. Everyone's sprouting an incredibly fashion fashion accessory, whether they like it or not, and most do. One person who doesn't like it is a local Hartwell Bank Bankner. Hartwell Bank Bachner. He exclaimed, I was really hoping for an Alice Beard outbreak this year. I really have a deep distrust for people that have a Grubber's Beard. Experts have given the advice that people should embrace the fashion virus and think about a long-term adopt adaptage and grooming. Duration 46. Watchers receive mood boost. You look damn good. So all my, all my people have beards now. Ambitious. Okay, cool. The guy got some bad ambitious now. Chart leveled up. Um, what do we need for research? Research. Camp planning. You know. Intelligence is good for research. And let's let's espionage. Let's get some espionage. Okay, so that, um, this is, this is done. Bathrooms are done. We can get better bathrooms now. Uh, so PR missions. We can start going out and recruiting more people and stealing stuff. It's, we don't know, still don't have to do with bombing. Wait, does... Yeah, it does have a beard. It's funny, even the ladies. Alright, so we need to upgrade this bad boy. Uh, drain. Shower stall. Let's get three. What do how many people we have? Six. We we'll get three of each. Oh, that over one. Uh, toilet. Uh, get a regular. That's a, those are sinks. I thought those were toilets. Wow, I can't. I can't tell the difference between a sink and a toilet. Alright, so that's... We got a better bathroom now. That's good. Hopefully they'll stop getting sick from, like, not washing their gosh dang hands. Have to go to the bathroom. Yeah, we got a... We got a I'm just, like, happy that he has a... I think they're trying to get their fun up as they're doing there. So I need a rec room. Oh, should I do a rec room instead? No, we'll wait. We'll do, wait. We'll do, we'll do a rec room after this. Oh, somebody's upset. What are you sad about, guy? What are you sad about? Sad about something. Is there food getting made? Ready for prayer. Um, okay. We basically assign one person to maintenance, one one person to food. Yeah, that's what the problem is. Okay, so you're you're not gonna do maintenance, you're going you're only gonna do food. That's all you work on there, guy.
Let them go on for 40 more hours. They can be happy they have beards for 40 more hours. Oh. This is fun. I've never seen this before. Like, people have come in, like, there's, like, viruses and stuff already. I know this thing got, a, like, a bunch of upgrade updates. Oh, okay, so that's, okay, so we have five prepared meals, six prepared meals. Okay, that's what's telling me. Uh, so we can do PR missions now. Uh, now I'm gonna take PR missions, a great old one. I can guide you through the, how to do it. Watch a mission. Okay, um, no time limit. Shouting, shouting, outing. Sign watcher. It increases our PR, PR rating increase, goes up, we get... We get experience, we get PR, no chance of fail. Who is the who's the guy we don't even it's not doing anything right now? He's like literally Bommy. So send Bommy, because we Bommy's not like doing anything. Oh wait, do we need? Oh we need someone that that can do planning. He's not good at planning. Let's just just understand hundred percent. Okay, what's this supposed to send him? Off the go, the success of the mission will depend on many factors like who you send and how hard it is. Let's see how they do. Review the mission results once the mission's complete. Okay, so we're done with that. Um, let's do. Let's do. Uh, so they can get their fun up. Okay. So maybe, maybe we can figure out what Bommy's good at. I mean... I guess we need to get Bommy's espionage up? Was that what it was that it needed? Shouting outing. I wish to uh, shout loudly about how wonderful the great one, oh, great old one is. Mission details, okay. Oh, he's gonna miss the... He missed the, the sermon. Here's Matt Skullington. Yeah, do that. This is done. Uh, mission turn on. Or turn in. Yeah, we got achievement unlocked. Inspiring agents. All right, so our PR rating went up. Nice. Uh, looks like they're good at shouting. Missions provide all sorts of rewards and benefits, such as unlocking new objects and providing more resources. Person personnel will not return for missions until they view you view the results. There's also a chance that a mission will trigger a mission encounter pop-up. These are mission situations that require you to make decisions. Until you they are dealt with, mission will not progress. What? Okay, so he needs to get his planning up. I hate that we had to spend our points to, like, get him out of negative. At least it's not negative or anything anymore. Okay, were, they, were they sleeping again? I should, like, zoom way to fuck out. You can see more of the map. Terrible food. Probably mean gruel. Very tired, very, uh, extremely bored. Well, I'm trying to, like... We'll get a thing up there, guy. So we're searching the... Yeah, this thing. Recreational room. And then we need to start working... He wanted this. This is what he wants. I can't even... Boom boost. I just might as well 
work my way down the list. We got, we got 11 meals left. I don't know what. Let us sleep tonight. It's the hardest thing up. Do 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 do. Gaining influence. Struggling to gain influ enough influence? Don't worry. We've all been there before. Therapy room is a great way to increase your influence output. Check the amount of available objects in room's summary tab and see if you have any remaining objects that can be placed. For example, placing maximum amount of mats in a meditation room. You can also increase the influence output by leveling up the watchers, the relevant skills, by choosing therapy room, and then assigning job from high priority in the priorities menu. I don't have anything that's good at like that. Oh shoot, we got a we got a level three mission. Makes our heat go like way up. Wow, I'm not gonna do a level three mission right now. Uh click on the resources on the HUD to access the stats menu. This this provides you with <gasps> huge range of information. It's uh, worth checking the, <laughs> the stats screen periodically to see how many cults, how your cult is running. Our faith is okay. I mean, I don't wanna, we don't wanna have to like, get too many followers at once because our faith drains like really fast. Isn't they're all tired? I don't understand what the bed is about. How much ingredients do we have left? I don't look like refresh, I guess. I'm going to build a recreation center now. Rec room for the people. Um, sermon, extra faith, object exposition missions, recruitment office, spirit chamber, or what is this? This combobulation therapy. If I was using this, will generate influence a small amount of money. All right, spill our recreation room though, real quick. Uh, rec room. How big does a rec room have to be? A ten by eight. Okay, so let's build a ten by eight. Um, I don't want to. want to patch it. Let's see here. Can we? So we need to go one bigger than that. Well, we could attach it. Let's just fucking attach it. Dang it. Let's build. Try. Oh, I'm speeding through the day too fast. I don't like, you know, just speed through the day. Uh, let's go sermon, I guess. 
Here's the faints uh, gained by, from a swimmer by 10%. Yeah, let's do that. And then uh, rooms. This is recreation. Two people that have points that you can level up. Slot machine. And we should probably put some light and stuff in here. Do we have any rugs? We do have rugs. We have rugs yet? everywhere, right? Make the one person happy that likes rugs. Okay, so what do you, what do, you do? That's gonna have intelligence. Charlotte, okay, what does Charlotte do? Charlotte, you are our researcher. I mean, it's our one guy that goes out and does stuff. We haven't... I don't know yet. He did not like... He's like worked on modules, though. You want to be want an efficient and successful cult, then you need to make sure you're getting the most out of your personal development of your watchers. Each job has two relevant skills. Spending the skill point... On these skills will yield better results for your watcher and assign a, the, the correct job. Watchers have a maximum skill level, which is set based on their quality. Low quality workers have very limited potential and, and will hit their max level very quickly. Yeah, that's why I need to get better fucking workers. How much? Okay, we got eight more hours for this. to, uh, let's see here, participate in a hang Hagged Network segment about in insect colonies on a two, uh, who was there, was it Bommy? Bommy. So it needs intelligence and public speaking. So let's give Bommy intelligence and public speaking. Uh, intelligence. Alright, send him out to do that. It's gonna raise our heat a little bit. But that's okay. What would it be, though? Would we need darkness? Embrace the evil in on many forms. Summon the dark tentacle lord. Burn the world to the ground. Sell your watcher's souls. Throw people in a great abyss. Influence. Infuse watchers with demonic powers. We're going to be a futurist. Embrace, embrace the future, including science, space, and robots. Rule the world through robot army. Blast off to a new, new planet. Liquidate flowers in the tasty beverages. Make flowers in attractive decorations. Conduct experiments on your watchers. Oh, there's a new one? Okay, they're making a new one soon. Uh, embrace the love of this in, in its peaceful forms. 
Rope plants, hook, your, hook up with local watchers in the area, create world peace, dance around maypoles, influence watchers with magical incense. I'm going to go evil, because, I mean, Cthulhu, right? With the cult of madness. Into the cult of madness! Okay, we don't want to speed through this again. Um, one more hour if this is done. Nothing's broken. Things do break down. Very good. Do 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 do. Uh, your guidance is required in an active mission. The mission will not progress. Okay, so what do we? Uh, you are, as you kindly strut down the street and notice an extremely tall, bearded old man with red, heads, red hair standing on a bench waving his arms about. This annoys you as you like the shout from the bench about mending dark. If you get closer, you hear this slobbering sounds more clearly. He's spouting a number of myths and conspiracy theories. Listen to his theories and he screams at nobody in particular. What theory piques your interest? He's talking about the great old one. Approach the man. As you approach, he fixes a wide-eyed syrup on you. He tells you about the various theories you've heard about the shouting become louder and gesturing more wildly. Ask about the great old one. Ask about the lizard people. Ask about Bigfoot. Ignore the loon and leave. You inquire about a story of the great old one, and he explains all about how it had recently graced the location in the city with the presence and bestowed upon it an art artifact of power. Ask a different theory. Tell him you know the great one too. He seems to confident and inflicted to hear your, your process knowledge of the great old one too. One moment he appears ecstatic to, that someone else believes him. The next he appears dubious that someone else could know anything about the great old one. He asks you to prove your knowledge by confirming the favorite color of the great old ones. Convincements red require people skilled one. Ask a different theory. You're not sure he, he wants to hear you guess it say it's blue. Ignore the linen. Give him it's red. He's overjoyed with at the answer. He's obvious uh, he's obviously know the great obviously know the great ones personally. You can he continues to talk about the great old one and reveals a recent visit to town hall. He you can investigate the further at a later date. New missions available. Do we unlock the mission by talking to this guy? This stuff is all new to me. Investigate rumors of the Great Old One at the Town Hall. Potential rewards, essence of the Great Old One. It's a level three. Okay, so we have to wait. No time limits. We'll wait on that. That essence of the Great Old One. Do 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 do. Ah, can somebody make some meals? We're down to three meals. Somebody not cooking. Uh, are we out of food already? Whatever, let's just go with a hundred, I guess. Alright, increase faith gain by sermons by 10%. Okay, cool. Uh, Prestige. It will come as no surprise you are having to use a bucket for a toilet, but it is actually great for morale. Watchers will suffer negative move effects when living in poor conditions. A cramped room with low quality items will make your watchers miserable. You can make watchers happy by building spacious rooms with high quality objects and decorations. Rooms will see. Okay, so we know this already. Um. Can we do bedrooms? Is bedrooms a thing? Bathroom upgrade, which we did. Faith, watcher cap, room boost. Allows the leader to boost the skills of anyone entering the room at the cost of influence. Unlocks new recreation items. Where's bedroom stuff at? You go. Oh, okay, it's not. Okay, it's not later on. Um. Let's do recruitment office, we can start getting some better people. Do -do 
do 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 so mission's still going on. We got six more minutes. So we got some heat from that, so we gotta like wait a while for our heat to drop. Start going on missions again. My heat's at 14. It's too high to try the cops to show up and uh, other nonsense. We'll get like protested. What is? Oh, they're waiting for the meditation rooms open. We have no the way it works in the meditation room. Works in the lobby. First not to work in module rooms. First not to work in module rooms. First, not to work in rooms that interact with flowers. First, to work in. First, to work in rooms that have contained rugs. Wait, I don't know what a module room is. I need to recruit some peoples. Like, nobody's working in here now. I have to like make somebody upset. Who's not? It's a good bombing to work in there for now. Once we get somebody else to like, work in there, These people are upset they're not getting into the into their room. Ooh, we could um put some more fuse in here. Oop, I'm trying to return them, search them around, don't I? Me facing this way. I had it right the first time. I had it facing the the idol and not the the the, the puppet or what pulpit, whatever it's called. I guess I can't. Okay, I don't have many more any more those in there. No, Paul is probably not happy being in here working with people, but I, he's got to deal with it for now. I don't know what a module is. Module room. Modular room. I don't know what that is. I'll have to look that up to see what the fuck that is. It's almost time for me to stop anyways, though. You went one plane for almost two hours. I gotta wake my wife up soon. And then I'll be back later tonight to play, um... Blur Witch. I don't know how long that game is. Okay, uh, new room. Watch us can walk out in the streets and attract potential better quality flowers to the lobby. It's not gonna be a recruitment office. I don't I don't think I have anybody that demands a recruitment office, though. It's a thing. I need, like, people to man these things. I need to recruit somebody who can work in a research office. Do we have anybody that's close to, like, getting close to being recruited? Uh, Allie White. I mean, we can, we can recruit. Luke Jake Jackinson. Oh, um, they got a good trait. I don't want to buy like a bunch of bad trait. I think I got quirks too. Fuck. I only got the one quirk. I think I missed my chance. I'm not gonna build another bed. I'm gonna build another bedroom soon.
Yeah, it shouldn't be, it shouldn't be crowded now. In the bedroom. I'm gonna, have to, I'm gonna have to build another bedroom. So we need for a recruitment office. Six by six. Um, we can put it back to the lobby, I guess. What is this anyway? This is a ten by eight. My six. Pew pew. Pew pew. See recruitment office. My desk. Let's see here. Yeah, so I can face the wall, right? And the whiteboard. Let's try to get, like, you know, a lamp or something. Do a nice potted plant in here. Yeah, there we go. Nice comfy chair. Okay, who are, who are I just I just I hired? I hired um is this Charlotte Huff no Anna Walters Works from refers to work in rooms that are, okay, so it interacts with people. Quirks at bad uh, intelligence negative two. Be criminal. Fuck. Or he's almost down. It's a level three thing, so more beds. Uh, yeah, I need to build another bedroom. How many people I have now? I have Can I sign beds. Is there like a way to sign beds? I don't think there is. I didn't even get another bedroom. We could build another bedroom over here. Split them up. Like three and three, I guess. A three and four. Um, let's put another... Put a, I'm gonna put a cell door on. I think that's funny. Okay, I'll wait for him to wake up and then I'll move some stuff around. And we'll let's we'll put a rug in here real quick. Uh see so rooms, bedroom. Decor. Rug. 
Put a rug in here. And then what else should we put in here? Dang it. It's a light. Guess that one person that comes in here that sleeps and needs a lamp. Sleep. What are we researching? Oh, um, objects, acquisition missions. We can like start stealing objects. Can I? Can I kind of like have the, the rug like in front of the door? It doesn't really matter. It's just gonna have the same. I don't know. Just like it seems like nice to have the. Okay, so we'll move. Wait. Four people in here. Well, I guess it's fine. And then, and then we need what? Three boxes. There. That should be better, right? Then I'm not cramped. Good. It's time for me to quit. I don't know if anybody's on for me to raid. Oh, speaking of which, a friend of mine is, I think, is find the forest. Let's see here. I don't know if they're streaming the forest, but they just started playing the forest. Let's see in a second. Okay, do we have any missions? We just saw that one PR mission. It's level three. We got a acquisition mission that's level three, which I'm not gonna do right now. So I don't want I don't like not want to lose a chance of getting that. So what do we? Researching? I, f I keep forgetting what we're researching. Oh, yeah, missions. I think I'm saying to slow it first until you start unlocking, like, missions and shit. Go with Anna to the street to sign people up. Yeah, you want to join a cult? How dare you? You abomination, par abominable parasite. Whoa. Whoa, really? I guess the people with the up the orange up buttons are people I can recruit. Oh, man, I got one. Object acquisition mission unlocked. Uh, what mission do we have? Mystery is to cure ob objects. Acquire prestigious objects in apartments by using boredom distraction tactics. What do I need, though? So I could... I need somebody that's, let's see, planning or bluffing. I got... He's gonna bluff. How many people can I send now? It's a thing. I don't know how many people I can send. I almost need a certain Charlotte, Sean, and Vanessa. Because they're each. Well, 
Well, I can only send one person. Fifty percent chance. Fifty percent chance. Yeah, I can't. It's nothing. It's good. Fifty percent chance. operations does not exist and not functional yet okay there is a way to like, send more than one person on a mission so i don't i know eventually i'm gonna set, be able to send more than one person um i guess we'll unlock the spirit chamber next power cat mat then we'll have to recruit another person to work in the spirit chamber i guess we'll just recruit people as we need them I probably should stop playing this. I gotta stop. I gotta eat lunch. I have to. My wife for medicine. Call my wife's doctor. Also, I'm getting a phone call. Alright, hold on, you guys.